Hello everyone, so in today's video, I will show you guys on how to change your DPI. So, if you want to change your DPI, there is plenty of ways on how you can change it. So, we, let's start with the first option. So, what you can do is just install the software of the brand of your mouse. So, if you're using Razer, use the Razer Synapse software. If you're using Logitech, use that software. And if you're using Glorious, etc., use their software. So just for example, so if you're using a Razer mouse, just open up Razer Synapse, go to dashboard, go to devices and look for your mouse and then go to performance and then you can change your DPI from here. So you can change it up to 8,500 DPI. So for me, I'm comfortable with using 400 DPI, so I will keep it at 400 DPI. So that is the first way on how you can change your mouse DPI on Windows. A second way that you can do is going to control panel. You can search it here in the search bar or you can have it pin, pinned in your taskbar. So open up control panel and then search for mouse. Go to mouse, go to pointer options and then you can change your mouse speed right here. So you can adjust it to very fast or adjust it to very slow. But the problem with this is it's not that accurate. So I wouldn't recommend this option. And then lastly, what you can do is open up your web browser, open up, the, open up any web browser that you're using, and then search up for mouse sensitivity. And then you will see this site right here that says same aim dash different game. So once you see this link, what you want to do is open, just press DPI analyzer, and then you can determine what DPI that you're using. So to Determine what DPI that you're using. What you want to do is just change the target distance to any number you want. So I, I usually use 10. And then what you want to do is just drag this circle right here to the end. So just drag that. And then as you can see, the website determined your DPI. So if your DPI says like it's 407, just round it off and make it 400. So now you have your DPI, which is 400. The next step that you will do is go to your web browser again and then search for raw Excel or raw acceleration and you will see this GitHub link. So open that GitHub link and then you will be led here. So next thing that you, you will do is click on release page right here in which you can download the software. And then what you want to do is just press this raw Excel zip and then just download it. And then once you're done downloading it, go to your downloads folder, extract the raw Excel file, and then open up the folder. And then just click the installer right here. And then you will need to restart your PC. And then once you're done, open up the application and then you will be greeted by this. So the only thing that you need to focus here is the sense multiplier. So to change your DPI to a specific DPI that you want, all you have to do is you need to calculate it first. So if you have a 400 DPI and then you want a 800 DPI on your mouse, what you want to do is open up your calculator and then input the DPI that you want. So I want 800 and then divide it with the DPI that you have now, which is 400 and then you will get two. So then after that, input the result that you got in the sense multiplier and then just click on apply and now i have 800 dpi on my mouse so yeah and then after that once you are going to power off your pc and open up again you need to open this application again so that you can set it again to 800 dpi so what i usually do is make a shortcut in the desktop so i can access it easily so yeah those are pretty much the ways on how you can change your DPI in Windows. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more tech tips. That is all.